Hey y'all, welcome back to the show. So we are celebrating the end of season one here on Yellow Texas by taking you through some of our top creature and critter encounters from the past year. And for our next destination, we're getting up close and personal with some of the most breathtaking aquatic animals from across the globe. And we did it without ever leaving Texas. Now let's send it over to Ariel and her hometown of Corpus Christi to check out the Texas State Aquarium. Located in Corpus Christi's scenic North Beach, the Texas State Aquarium takes visitors on an incredible journey where they can encounter over 460 different species of spectacular aquatic life. Their mission? To engage people with animals, inspire appreciation for our seas, and to support wildlife conservation. Welcome to my hometown of Corpus Christi, Texas. Today, we're at a very special place. We're at the Texas State Aquarium, where I'm gonna take you on a journey where you're gonna meet some of the most magnificent animals you've ever seen. I met with the president and CEO of the Texas State Aquarium, Tom Schmid. So can you tell me a little bit about the overall experience here at the aquarium? Sure, so we're really excited about our Caribbean journey. This is a brand new expansion to the Texas State Aquarium. Starting from the upland jungles, through the coastal habitats, and out into the big coral reefs, visitors will be able to experience every habitat that you would imagine trekking through the Yucatan. Now with the Caribbean journey, we've, we're moving guests on a journey from the Gulf into the Western Caribbean Sea. There's a lot of exciting things for folks to do here. This is a great place for folks to have a great family experience. So from dolphins to river otters to our sharks, even our 4D theater. And so we hope folks come here, they experience all these things, but we also want them to learn a little bit along the way. From stingrays to barracudas to some pretty serious looking sharks, the aquarium's newest exhibit, Caribbean Journey, takes visitors deep below the surface to the twisted wreckage of a sunken Spanish ship, putting them face to face with some of the most infamous ocean predators. Okay, so where exactly are we? So we are in the Yucatan jungle. There's uh, birds all around you. And then kind of once you get through here, you open up into the greater kind of coastal communities, which is our large uh, H-E-B shark habitat, as well as our coral reef exhibit. You said shark habitat. Shark habitat. The sharks, uh, all the eels, the stingrays are all right here. And so you're as close as, as you can be. And so it's kind of a unique experience and one of, one of the rare aquarium experiences in the country. We actually uh, track how much they eat. How many calories does a shark eat? <laughs> 2,500 to 3,000 calories per feeding, which might be spread over a couple of days. These are some decent sized animals. Speaking of calories, it was time to feed these magnificent creatures. Nobody likes a hungry shark. So we start off by distracting our small fish. We have a lot of small fish in the exhibit and we want to reduce the competition between all of the animals. We actually row out on a boat, so it takes the two of us up here feeding, and then we actually have a third person that will be watching down below at the window below us, and they're keeping a record with a clipboard. They're watching that feed, tracking how much they're getting. Now that the sharks were fed and happy, it was time to meet another less intimidating critter. All right, we're here with Lauren Wilson, the curator for birds and mammals here at the Texas State Aquarium, and we have a very special guest. Would you like to introduce her? Yes, this is Zena. She is our two-toed Linnaeus sloth. She is about three years old, and guests can see her pretty much every day on exhibit or even sometimes free roaming around our free flight aviary. There you go, Zena. <laughs> How did she get the name Zena? Actually, is short for the order of mammals that she belongs to. <laughs> She's okay, she's just eating. <laughs> if anyone is interested in getting more behind the scenes with our animals and even get to feed some of our animals, but exclusive encounters is a must do. There you go. Well, Y'all are incredibly messy eaters. <laughs> Want an even closer look at some of your favorite aquatic creatures? Then get ready for an experience you won't soon forget. The Texas State Aquarium offers visitors the chance to go behind the scenes, letting them feed and interact with birds, sharks, sea turtles, and yes, even dolphins. All right, if my job wasn't cool enough already, I'm here with Merit Grisecki. She's a trainer here at the Texas State Aquarium, and she's gonna to talk to us a little bit about these wonderful creatures that are right behind us. <laughs> That's right, these guys are Kai and Shadow. They're our two oldest dolphins here at the aquarium. So this is Kai. And <laughs> he's on his way down to say hello. Go ahead and wave hello at Kai. Hi, Kai. 
<laughs> Perfect. And then the next thing you're going to do um, is just kind of dance back and forth. No. Like that. Perfect. No. Keep going. <laughs> awesome. Um, great job. That was pretty good dancing, huh? Absolutely. <laughs> It's such a privilege to be able to work with them. I love every day uh, working with our dolphins and it's amazing to get to know their personalities um, and it's so fun to have them as co-workers. Well, thank you so much. It's been a privilege just standing here and being with you in high and shadow. <laughs> thank you. That's pretty well, nice, huh, boys? <laughs> Want to check out Texas State Aquarium for yourself? Visit the link below to learn more.